Last Sunday, as pro-choice supporters reacted to the leaked Supreme Court draft opinion that will likely overturn Roe v. Wade, a series of videos shot in Lower Manhattan went viral. In one, a group of young men stood before a doorway at the Basilica of St. Patrick's Old Cathedral, praying with the rosary while protesters demonstrated outside the church gates. Let's take a look. We beseech thee that meditating upon these, these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they poured us after that. Show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for By the afternoon on Sunday, that video had gone viral, being shared on social media by far-right Republican representatives Paul Gosar and Marjorie Taylor Greene, who praised the men as heroes defending their churches against the abortionist horde. The young man in the America First hat, featured prominently in that video, was later filmed at the same location, where he appeared to be shouting mocking vulgarities at protesters from the church steps. You don't have any people. people! You don't have any I am the people! The people have decided, the court has decided. Uh, when they say no choice, we say no choice. No choice. You when have they no say no choice, we, we say, say no choice. No choice. Abortion is abortion. The young right-wing activist affiliation with the white nationalist, racist, and anti-Semitic America First, or Groiper movement, was revealed on a popular live stream show Sunday night, where host and movement leader Dalton Clodfelter said he recognized the man in the videos and called him to join the show. I'm calling him right now. My nigga. Yo, what's going on, Dalton? What's up, Chad? Not too much. I mean, you know, it's, it's uh, pretty crazy right now with all this stuff going on. Yeah, I bet. Are you, are... I had a lot of fun yesterday. Obviously, a, a very solemn and prayerful event. Yeah. You know, with these demonic creatures. I mean, that's what they are. These people were animals. Barely human, frankly. This... None of that seemed to matter to the right-wing politicians and media who continue to hold this man up as a hero of the faith. Resistance, the activist wing of Catholic far-right media outlet Church Militant, is now mobilizing supporters to counter protest Planned Parenthood marches scheduled for this Saturday in Chicago, Nashville, Washington, San Antonio, Los Angeles, and other cities. On Monday, the alternative social media site Telegram, Claude Felter seemed to call on Groypers to attend these rallies, using language identical to a resistance post describing the mobilization. All of this appears to be a part of a broader pattern of increasing overlap between the far right, including overtly white nationalist movements, with the extreme right-wing fringe of the Roman Catholic Church. In post-Trump America, it appears white nationalists and Christian nationalists are putting their differences aside in a push to roll back abortion rights and enshrine white Christian dominance. Thank you for tuning in to Raw Story TV. Please be sure to check out headlines at rawstory.com. Stay informed and tap below to take action by liking, subscribing, and joining all those who like their news raw too.